the people. Public option. Now. The people. Thank you all again for coming. Despite the naysayers and the critics, our country is now closer than ever to health care reform. It's been almost 50 years. 61. I heard on the news today, the, uh, the leader of the Mayo Clinic, who actually does want a public option, even though he's not, not saying it, said today on uh, the Charlie Rose Show that the average cost per patient in Miami, Florida, was $16,000. The average cost for a similar patient in Hawaii is $5,000. So what do we want? <laughs> we want a public option in health care reform. Yesterday, the House introduced this reform proposal, and this morning, the Senate Health, Education, Labor, and Pensions Committee reached a major landmark by passing a similarly strong proposal for health care. The bill was debated for more than 50 hours and includes more than 160 Republican amendments. This is a hopeful sign of bipartisan support for the final product. The House and Senate health proposals take what's best of our current system and make it the basis of our future system. Reducing costs, increasing quality, ensuring fair treatment of consumers by the insurance companies. Both plans include a health insurance exchange, a marketplace that will allow families and small businesses to compare prices, services, and quality so we can choose a plan that makes the most sense to them. The choices include a public health insurance option that would make health care more affordable by increasing competition, providing more choices, and keeping insurance companies honest. But our work is not done. We need your help. Thank you all for increasing the attendance here today, which is higher than the attendance on our first event here on the 9th. And we're going to be back. We've got to communicate with Senator Nelson, who is on the Finance Committee. They may be voting as early as this week on that committee. We need to get in there that we in South Florida particularly need a health care option. So we in South Florida have to get back on the phones. And we have an organization here, Organizing for America, that will put you to work. We have been phone banking on Wednesdays in Miami Beach and uh, North Miami and other locations, you need to go to ObamaObama.com, the, the website on this, on this card right here, and look for the event near you. This Saturday we're going out on the beach and we're getting people to sign these pledges. So I'm asking you now, who has a pledge form here? Can you help me pass out these pledge forms? They're on clipboards. I need everybody here to sign the pledge, to stand with the President on his three points that include the public option. We've got to have your names and we've got to get those names in to our representatives. So, look on the website, find the event near you, and we've got to keep fighting. This concludes our event. Thank you so much.